Occupy Wall Street protesters in New York City set their sights on Goldman Sachs Thursday, holding a mock trial the financial firm in Zuccotti Park. As the protesters then made their way to Goldman's offices, police flanked the marchers with handcuffs at the ready. After presenting their findings at Goldman's doorstep, several protesters sat down and refused to leave. New York City police then placed 17 protesters under arrest. It was really amazing to see some of my friends stepping up again, you know, getting arrested for the second or third time. Um, people were really committed, and it's just it's amazing. Over the course of the protests nationwide and in other countries, police have arrested hundreds for trespassing, disorderly conduct, resisting arrests, and other violations. Some protesters say the police should be targeting the bankers, who they refer to as the 99%, rather than targeting the protesters. The police are uh, actually protecting the wrong people. They're arresting the wrong people. They're all wrong. They look pathetic. New York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg says the protesters' continued refusal to stay on the sidewalks during marches could justify a move by police to evict them from Zuccotti Park. Mark Hamrick, Associated Press.